is Lamore Schaffman. I'm here at CTIA 2009, and I'm here with Ted Yanuzzi from Didmo, and he's going to talk to us, us about their new offering that just came out. Hi, Lamore. It's a pleasure. Thank you very much. Uh, the company is Didmo. We're out of Stockholm, Sweden. Uh, basically, we uh, have a background in ad wrapping technology for mobile games, and uh, we've created a new product that we think was is rather interesting. It's uh, a product called Magmito, and uh, what Magmito is is a way that uh, it's a tool, it's an online tool that uh, is a free way for people to create content for mobile phones. So uh, basically you're going to go to our website, you're going to register, you're going to create content using easy to use templates, you're going to bring in your own pictures, your own content, uh, text, graphics, you'll be able to do things like bring in a map function, you'll be able to add forms, quizzes, polls, things like that. And once you've created your application, then basically you're going to buy SMS credits. It's basically uh, the idea is that uh, you just pay for the distribution to the people that you want to send it to. And uh, we have a, a, an ad uh, portion to that. If you want to uh, save a little bit of money on the cost of distribution, which will always be under the cost of a, of a stamp, uh, then we have a, an ad option that you can opt in for and say uh, that you agree to advertising and then you get those credits for an even cheaper uh, price. Uh, if you're a company, then you probably may not want advertising, and so therefore you pay a little bit more for the credits. But it's basically just pay for the delivery, and the tool is free to create and play with. Wonderful. Can we see some of the applications that you've Yes, with it? it's uh, my pleasure. I'm going to show you a little application. Here it's the launching. There's the company logo. Get to know it. It's a hot little ball of fire. Uh, so basically, uh, we say go in. I, I've gone into the application here. It was a tool that I wanted to create for all the people uh, that are with us. That's our little help menu. If you don't interact with the uh, product, uh, it brings up the help menu auto automatically so it thinks that you're having problems. And you just click on any button and it goes away. So here's the travel info. I just click on that and now I see all the, the scheduling for everybody that's on our team when they were arriving here at the show and the flight data, all the e-ticket numbers. And I easily grabbed all this information from uh, uh, Skype chats that we had and from emails that people sent me. I just quickly gathered all this data and cut and pasted it into the application so I have everything from the hotel and uh, all of the, uh, the the flight data and that sort of thing so very quickly even on the plane because it's an application I could launch this tool and know when we were arriving when the next flight was what was the terminal we had to go into blah 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 uh, so if I go back quickly I'll show you the schedule so now I have all the list of meetings that we needed to attend unfortunately I can't show you I have to go through them very quickly so that you don't know who we were talking Okay, too, but you get the idea. <laughs> you can go slow later on. <laughs> so here's uh, also the important numbers, and this is really good because you always are quickly looking for Bob's number, Phil's number, Susie, whoever is in the team, and you want to quickly get to that number, as well as the emergency contact numbers, because whenever you're visiting a city or a place, you would like to have that in case you see something or you're involved in an accident. You want to be able to quickly have the contact information, so I wanted to make sure I provided that for everybody on the team. And probably lastly, one of the most important things is to have a map and our tool integrates Google Maps so here I gave them a map to where the location is of the uh, the Hilton Hotel which is where we're staying in room 414 uh, and below it of course uh, the application allows us to put in uh, uh, description information so I can do stuff like here's the hotel where it's located and the telephone number and, and this is really handy because if you need if you if I end up somewhere late at night after uh, uh, a long business meeting uh, I may need to know how to get home if I'm walking or if I need to show a cab driver this is I can quickly hand him the phone and within a few seconds give him that so that's kind of our tool uh, the idea is to create content and we're hoping that people try it play with it have fun with it and actually get some content out there and, and we want the feedback it's in beta right now and we're looking for people to, to play with it and get get back to us with uh, what they do that's great actually I want to ask you four more questions yes. so now you, this is clearly have a robust back end because you just cut and paste you grab from wherever is really simple, simple for even people who are not developers to actually go in and start developing some product. Yes. I mean, we, we really wanted to make it that way so that there were, it was template based. I mean, if, you, if you're if you really good at creating, you can just choose four blank pages and create whatever content you want. Uh, if you're a mother making a thing for a birthday party or you're planning a wedding or, or some kind of event or you got a basketball team or whoever, you can go in and quickly change the content that's there. It's really just to give you a, some creative ideas and what you can do, but you can change backgrounds, you can change colors and all of that stuff, and, and all of 
the back end creation part, and that's really a, a, the impressive part of the tool is that the content that you create uh, creates an application that will run on any phone. So the content goes on to any phone, whether you have an iPhone, whether you have a Windows mobile phone, whether you have any of the Java-based phones that are out there. Uh, whatever content you make is you design it and create it once and distribute it to many. Okay, so this can go on. This can be downloaded by how many? What kind of phones can you actually grab this application? Yep. So any Java enabled phone can launch the applications and uh, that's probably about a little over 80% of okay. the market uh, and for phones like iPhone and for Android phones uh, and for say Windows mobile phones we create the uh, application automatically generates a WAP version a sort of like a little mini website version of the same application so we can safely distribute your message your your content to any of the phones Wonderful. and uh, that's where we're hoping that it's going to take off. Yeah, this is great. Ted, thank you so much. Pleasure's mine. Pleasure. Thanks, Mark.